hello guys welcome back to patience cooking if you're new here please subscribe and to my returning subscribers thank you very much for always coming back today i want you to join me make this okra soup recipe this is a very easy and simple recipe that you can do at home especially when you are in a haze and you want to rush out it's a traditional soup i think most africans will know this soup and even some part of um, latin america so i'll be using um, turkey and fresh fish for this recipe and this is me just mar marinating this turkey with black pepper no spice salt and some two maggi cube and you can also add some other spices that you're interested in so yeah i like to cook without water for like 15 to 20 minutes and then i'm going to be frying this turkey because I will need to use this for this soup. And you guys, the turkey is ready and brown. And this is me blending the okra. I actually blend this okra without water. So, because I don't want it to be so watery, so I decided to blend it without water. I decided to also divide it into two because actually with this pepper soup okra, you have to slice everything. But since I didn't really have the time to slice everything, I decided to divide it and blend it more of the okra and just slice a little bit okay but if you want to slice everything it will be good for you but if you're in a haze just blend it as i've done and you are good to go i'm also blending the spice i need i you know it's pepper soup so i need pepper garlic ginger and some um red pepper for this recipe so i just blended it and now remember we already cooked the turkey and i still had some uh, marinated water left for the turkey so i'm going to be using that water and i also added some water into it so this is me slicing the onions and after slicing the onions i'll just pour it in the pot and put the already blended spices that i needed for this recipe that we blended and after that i'll just stir everything added some salt add some maggi cube some black pepper some no spice any spice you want for this recipe guys you can add because it's a spicy soup so just put the spice that you are more comfortable with in this recipe so let it cook until it bubbles then it's time for you to put in the turkey and then when you're done putting the turkey you can now put in the okra guys because the okra is actually the reason why we are making this soup so yeah put in the okra and um, let it sit and cook for like five minutes and then you put in the fish remember fish is very easy to cook that's why i decided to put it this time because i didn't want it to like break in the course of the cooking so I actually put it when i knew that very soon my soup will be ready so i covered this and let it cook for like 10 minutes and why i'm cooking that i decided now to add my vegetable that i'll be needing for this recipe and i'm using spinach leaves so i'm just slicing them but before slicing i washed it very very well you guys so make sure it's well washed because you don't want to eat that and yeah this is me we also need crayfish for this recipe guys so i first of all put crayfish for the taste if you know crayfish you know that it has this taste that is so beautiful for a soup like this you must have crayfish guys and then i added the spinach leaves that i already sliced so when i did that i just stirred the soup and cover and let it cook for like five to eight minutes guys and the soup will be ready <laughs> Uh, 
and there you go you guys this soup is looking soupish and it's looking so delicious and tasting beautiful guys i enjoy this soup i really really enjoy this soup for the easter though i wasn't able to edit the video and post but i made this soup for easter and it tastes really great if you're if you're new here please subscribe and if you love this recipe please try it at home and let me know how it turned out and don't forget to like share and subscribe to my channel see you in my next video thank you very much bye